Not another prequel, surely. Welcome back guys, it's the Raw Geek here. They either do prequels or sequels to old movies now, quite a lot. Or obviously they do remakes often as well. But yeah, sometimes the prequels, they just sound odd. And I did feel that slightly with this. Now obviously this is a picture from Rosemary's Baby, the well, 1968 movie. The original movie is worth watching. If you don't know what it's about, then you're not really going to understand what this prequel movie is about either. But the gist of it is, and spoilers... Her baby is the Antichrist and the spawn of Satan. So, just uh, another Tuesday afternoon. But then, I was saying maybe the prequel doesn't make sense, but maybe it does make some sense, because there is, like, the satanic cult who have orchestrated all this, that are in on it, uh, in the movie. It's obviously from a book as well, but... So maybe it's about them, or something like that? I don't know. And it says here, trailer for the Rosemary's Baby prequel film, Apartment 7A, starring Julia Garner. So that's where Rosemary moved into with her husband. And that looks like it's a demon, <laughs> straight away. Right, it says uh, Paramount has released the first trailer for Apartment 7A, which serves as a prequel to director Roman Polanski's classic 1968 horror movie, Rosemary's Baby. I'm not going to say much about the director, but... There is some strange stuff linked to all of that, but anyway. Uh, it looks like it will be a good, unsettling and eerie movie, but not as good as the original. Well, never, well, they never are. They just don't have any new ideas, so they just keep copying old stuff and hoping the current audience haven't heard of it, because they're not cultured. <laughs> I'm not sure you're cultured for watching a horror movie, but you, you know what I'm trying to say. It says Julia Garner stars in the film, and the new story is set at the iconic Bramford Building in New York City, which is where the original film took place. Oh, that's strange. It's a new story, and it's an iconic place, which is exactly where it was before. <laughs> I'm being a bit hard. I'm hoping it's going to be good, but I just sometimes I just think, what's the point of them doing this? Garner plays a struggling young dancer who suffers a devastating injury, and she finds herself drawn in by dark forces when a peculiar, well-connected, older couple promises her a shot at fame. Alright, so this this older couple, they're probably, like, rich, are they? They got the hookup, they got Satan on speed dial. Say, so, oh, make this person a star. You know, that's how, that's how it all works. Every celebrity, no, I'm joking. <laughs> when fellow resident and influential Broadway producer offers her another chance of fame, it seems that all her dreams are finally coming true. However, after an evening she can't fully remember, disturbing circumstances soon have her second-guessing the sacrifices she's willing to make for her career, as she realises that something evil is living not only in Apartment 7A, but in the Bramford itself. Apartment 7A is the perfect way to kick off the Halloween season, said Jeff Grossman, Executive Vice President. I'm sure he would say that. He's not going to say, no one watched this movie, don't give us any money, is he? <laughs> Anyway, it says here, Apartment 7A debuts exclusively on Paramount Plus on September 27th. So just ready in time for the spooky season, but interestingly, it's just on their their own platform. So maybe they maybe they're not expecting much of it. <laughs> anyway, let's take a look at the trailer. Okay, so this is Apartment 7A. Play. I came here for one reason. Get famous. To make something of myself. Dracula. To be on stage. To see my name in big lights. But dreams don't always come true. Ouch. That's ouch. That's ouch time. You know, when we found you... Whoa! You lost, honey! Don't trust them. You were kind of a mess. We want to help. The place mm. is yours if you want it. Terry, you don't even know these people. Look, moving into my own place feels like a first step. Uh-oh. Don't do it. Don't do it. I think this belonged to your old tenant. She skipped out of here like Cinderella oh. She was an night. actress too, was she? All I want is to dance. Show me. Oh, yeah. Again. 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 Being on stage isn't Ow. worth this. What's a Honda? 
Oh dear. Can you just leave, please? Oh, really? Maybe I shouldn't have bought every single thing handed to you on oh, a dear. silver platter. <laughs> There's something wrong. These people with are these crazy. People. <laughs> I think something happened to the girl who lived here before me. Yeah. They did ungodly things to her. And now they've chosen you. What do you mean? Oh, no. But I need to know what's happening to me. What's going on? This is crazy. Demons. The name of in big lights. This is so much bigger than me. And yeah, I look, it's all the elite this. look. This yeah, that's weird. Like cult. To play. Baby's here to stay. <sighs> that looks alright, actually. I think I would put that on. I haven't got Paramount Plus, so I can't, but, you know. Uh, I'd watch that at some point, for sure. Potentially, maybe, before watching Rosemary's Baby right after. It did actually look alright, I have to say. You know, it's not like a, a slasher horror flick that you go to the cinema for. It's, it's more psychological, isn't it? But it is interesting with that sort of satanic cult. You know, and they're, they're probably all rich, aren't they? And, you know, they, they dine on fresh blood or something, probably. I don't know. But, yeah, it was just kind of cool to see... The weird things i don't think it's anything amazingly special but i think if you're a fan of that type of horror movie and of rosemary's baby then yeah absolutely i would say watch that it looks quite good and i, I think i will but that about do it for this one uh, i just wanted to you know touch base and say hello basically so guys if you like that please click like make sure you subscribe for more videos like this and i'll see on the next video and until then remember there's a prequel to be made for anything apparently Okay, bye. Guys, if you're still here, you're awesome. Uh, but as you are still here, why not check out some of my other videos? Oh, and if you haven't already, please click subscribe. Laters, haters.